Hey, I'm Ty Dyes. And I'm Lou Balcheza. And we are Trucker. And this is the producer masterclass for our track, Detroit. I had an idea, which was actually called 2014-35. So the, the, the 35th idea. That's pretty brief as far as producers, <laughs> names can go though, they can get long. Yeah, so it was the 35th track of the year 2014. And um, me and Louis were speaking about doing like a, a collab act and we had this cool name called Trucker. And um, we were like, what are we gonna do? It was also the first release of our label, Bone Town. So we were like, cool, let's um, let's look at a few options. So I played in the track and he dug it. It was quite a weird track for me because it was, um, it's not something that I've, it's not part of my usual repertoire. It's quite, it's quite out there. For us, like how we conceptualize the track and stuff or choose what's, what makes Trucker is kind of, if either of us make a song which is not necessarily in our normal, you know, sound, you know, often you'll veer off from your sound or you're on your way to discovering another sound and stuff and kind of our tracks that get pushed to the side or get put on hold, we we collaborate uh, under the name Trucker. Basically Trucker is all the weird ass tracks. Well, Isaac brought the tune and we met at Bone Town Studios and I brought the all the sound effects and stuff and we sat with the, with the stuff and we basically built this the scene which we conceptualize as this like rogue space cowboy who is listening in on these police scanners and he hears about like some incident and he runs down the stairs and breaks He's stuff like, I'm all gonna along go the way. kick some ass y'all yeah and he like breaks into this car which is this Mustang, you know, and uh, he speeds off into the night and he's trying to beat the police there so he can kill this hillbilly, pretty much. Yeah, it kind of it made this really interesting, just moody kind of collab between the track and this Foley. It just brought a, a whole other dimension to this tune. Yeah, so uh, Isaac did the tune in, uh, he created the song in Logic and I did the sound design in Ableton Live. And we're gonna show you how we how we did it and yeah, how we created this uh, this scene of the space cowboy. So here we've got the track open in Logic. There you go, 2014-35, new arrangement. <laughs> this is the bass line on its own. That's what it looks like. Um, Basically it started off as a MIDI track that I rendered to audio just because it was easier to work with. I'll bus the MIDI channel to an audio channel, record it while I'm doing the while I'm doing a take and just record what I'm doing on the synth into audio. So then it's done and I don't have to tweak it and it just is what it is and it feels more natural to me, it's more fun first of all, and then the take is the take and there's no going back. That's like it's like commitment to the take and that's it so basically um, I started with the sound called tubular bass on the monopoly which is a software synth that I'm a big fan of and it's quite simple I tweak the sound a bit but then all I'm really doing is just like opening the filter Records a long take, and I basically just cut the bits that I like and use that. Now we're looking at the project in Ableton Live. Here's the track, the complete mastered track uh, at the bottom. Here, so this runs underneath the whole sound piece of sound design. Um, and what we've got is, yeah, that this is the, the like the cut-ups, the the individual sound effects for for the scene. So, for example, here is just the revolver draw. So that's a guy pulling his revolver out of his wooden satchel. There we go, and then like, yeah, what's this uh, revolver barrel spin? And here, it's a Magnum 357, bullet swish, bullet impact, there's a body fall through glass. And to chunk that up, we added a couple more body falls on the landing. So basically all of these elements, we like visualized what was going to happen, you know, and we figured like what would happen is this car would arrive, uh, yeah, the car arrives over here, stopped his car, gets out the car, 
He pulls his gun and he walks up to these guys and he shoots them. So I'm gonna play you just the sound design by itself. Uh, there's some cool automation stuff. It's just really about like bringing the levels up where they needed to be up and you know, bringing the music back and letting the sound effects ride high and vice versa. And then some panning of the cars driving past and you know, uh, driving from left to right and just really creating like a sense of space when you were listening to the track. So you could like be in this, in this, in this world, you know, in Sin City. If you want to know more about it, please send us a mail and we'll do like a full in-depth explanation on this track or any of the other tracks. Just get a hold of us, let us know you want it, and uh, and we'll uh, we'll we'll put up a full full-length uh, producer masterclass. See you next time.